So let us talk about meta search engines today. So to engineer a search engine is a challenging task. Search engines index tens and thousands of millions of web pages, including or involving a comparable number of distinct terms. So they answer 10 of millions of queries every day. You may imagine that whenever you talk on or type on any Google's or any asks or any Bing's uh, searching, then that particular keyword is searched with thousands, tens and millions of data available on internet, you know, wherever it is found and you get the most relevant search result. That is why engineering a search engine is really a challenging task. Uh, let us see the definition first. Uh, meta search engines are search engines, tools that pass queries onto many other search engines. This is very important. This is where we start. That meta search engine means query to many other search engines and or directory and then summarize all the results in one handy interface. Not just one search engine, many search engines. So many people use meta search engine to get even more comprehensive result for their search query. For example, a simple search for puppy things like images, videos and multiple content suggestions, right? Every word is related or is relevant to some or the other material available on internet in any form. So why this meta search? Why? Individual search engines uh, don't cover all the web by themselves. Individual search engines are prone to spamming people trying to raise their ranking profile, right? So there are things, there are issues with uh, individual search engines. The concept of this uh, meta search engine came into existence in which a single interface provided search result that was generated by multiple search engines rather than a single search engine, rather than just single search engine algorithm, uh, it was generated by multiple search engine. Uh, Daniel at Colorado uh, University developed search savvy, which let us uh, users search up to 20 different search engines at one and a number of directory. What is and how this particular thing operates? So a meta search engine accepts a single search request from the user. A meta search engine does not create a database of web pages, but generates a virtual database to integrate data from all multiple sources. And since every search engine is unique and has a different algorithm, that is their USP for generating rank data duplicates will there, uh, therefore uh, will be generated. There will, there will be always be uh, duplicates. So to remove duplicates, a meta search engine processes this data and applies its own algorithm. So it's not that only you are collecting data from many search engines and just giving it to the user. No, you are collecting it, then you are applying your own algorithm. This is how uh, this tech savvy work, which I just mentioned. So when a meta search engine con uh, contacts other search engines, these search engines will respond in any of the three ways. They will either uh, cooperate and provide complete access to the interface of the meta search engine, including private access to the index database and will inform the meta search engine of any changes made upon the index database. Or search engines can behave in a non-cooperative manner. They can cooperate, they can non-cooperate, thereby they will not deny or provide any access to interface. And the third is the search engine can be completely hostile and refuse the meta search engine total access to the database. And in serious uh, circumstances, they seek legal methods. So this is the architecture of a meta search engine. First, let us see this. These are various uh, resources, but we will query from here. The query will uh, be fired from this place. Then we have a meta search engine. We have different search engines and all together the search engine, they, they do something with the resources which are available and they find out the best relevant data for you, information for you 
and meta search engine combine them and uh, you know applying their own logarithm it gives you a response so this is user interface this is the query this is the dispatcher you have knowledge personalized these are the search engine one search engine two search engine three and display this is the web this is how uh, your uh, meta search engine architecture is seen so we have a user interface normally resembles search engine interfaces with option for typing of a search or a media and search engines to use then you have a dispatcher as you just saw it generates actual queries to the search engine by using the user query and it may involve choosing and expanding search engines to use and then display generates the result page from the replies received and may involve ranking parsing clustering of the search result or just play this plain stitching it depends on the algorithm which this meta search engine used then personalization and knowledge this personalization may contain either or both personalization may involve weighting of or giving weights of search results query engine for each user then this savvy search engine savvy search engine we just talked about is a meta search engine that is capable of analyzing other search engines and making independent decision on whether or not to interact with them the so savvy search engine is selective in order to provide information that is useful for user it was created to address two goals first to expand the chance of uh, returning reliable links and to reduce the consumption of web resources so it is also capable of monitoring an engine's performance in search engine performance in a long run to determine how compatible and how well a particular search engine respond to a particular query there is one more engine meta seek engine this is a meta search engine that deals with image retrieval meta uh, seek engine is able to select and conduct analysis of various image search engines so the selected engine are monitored and ranked based on the ability to provide relevant images this is for relevant images in relation to the user's query and a score is applied accordingly so the score are indexed to retain references for new search queries this meta seek engine also takes extra caution to ensure that the images are available in the database by storing visual features for every single images so what are the advantages of this meta search engine such as all the major search engine at once so searching them all individually is not necessary and has an easy to use toolbar available for download and also allow you to search the white pages and the yellow pages as well and uh, free and easy to use similar format to other search engines so you will not feel that you are uh, typing somewhere else you are on google or on bing or whichever search engine you use then it is customizable for user preferences but disadvantages you'll get a lot more results because it searches multiple engines so you have to be specific and mainly provides only the main hits for other search engines so results that are more obscure on the other search engines may not show up you may not find what you want and uh, not as practical as say google or yahoo uh, not very well known today that is why i am telling you about this and not really any more reliable than the other search engines this is a point of uh, discussion or debate so thank you so much i try to give you idea about meta search engines take care